so here's how to play Wonder by Shawn Mendes on the uke. Um, I went ahead and did a guitar lesson for this tune already and just thought I'd follow it up with a, a nice little ukulele tutorial. I just got this ukulele today, so uh, I'm pretty excited. Um, but anyway, yeah, let's go ahead and get started. So uh, four chords. Um, and I'll, I'll try to show you like an even more simplified way to do this. So I'll show you the four string way and then I'll show you the three string way afterwards. If, if, if the four string way is too hard for you, skip ahead to the three string way. So let's go ahead and uh, take a look at the four string way. So we need to start with an E chord. So you're just gonna set your index finger on the second fret of the first string. Now you gotta do you got to reach way up here with your middle finger to the 4th fret of the 4th string and your ring finger is going to kind of smash underneath that on the 4th fret of the 3rd string and then pinky 4th fret of the 2nd string, okay? So that gives you the first, uh, the first chord. Now the strum pattern I'm using is really very simple. Um, same as my guitar tutorial, I'm just strumming down, up, down, up time down up down up down then I'm going to move to an F sharp minor so take your middle ring and pinky off and then just slide your index finger up two frets to the fourth fret of the first string then you're going to set your middle finger down on the second I'm sorry on the fifth fret of the second string then ring finger jumps up here to 6th fret of the 4th string, and then pinky sets right underneath that on 6th fret of the 3rd string. And I'm going to do the same strum pattern there, same for all these chords. So again, that's just down, up, down, up, down. Now I know a lot of you like to just strum with just your thumb. You could do that. Um, I use kind of a classical guitar technique where I strum with my index finger fingernail on the way down and then my thumbnail on the way up. And that takes a little time to get to know how to do so just strum it the way that's most comfortable for you. So again that was down, up, down, up, down. Alright now we gotta go to a C sharp minor. So now you just leave your ring finger where it is and you're going to take your other fingers off and then shift your index finger up so that it bars across the fourth fret of the first, second, and third string. So your ring finger is still where it was on that sixth fret of the fourth string, but your index finger is now barring across the fourth fret on the first, second, and third string. That gives you C sharp minor. So you're going to strum that same way. And finally, that leads us to the next chord, the A chord, which I think is a little easier. It's my favorite chord to play in the song here. So you've just set your index finger on the first fret of the third string, middle finger, second fret of the fourth string, and then the first and second string are open. So you're going to, again, strum the same way. Now you will notice that there's a couple little parts in the song where he, he'll go to an A minor real quick. Um, and to get the A minor, all you gotta do is just take your index finger off. That gives you that A minor. You'll hear that in the intro actually. You hear that right off the bat on the intro. Um, you don't have to do it, but it just it might add a nice little um, embellishment if you wanna kinda follow the song a little more closely. So. If you're gonna play it like that, um, we would go like this. We go. Okay, so you just roll right into that A minor. But you don't you don't have to do that. You can get by with just playing um, E F sharp minor, C sharp minor, A for the entire song. But if you want to throw in that A minor, it's really easy. You just let off with your index finger. All right, so now if the four string way was too tough, let's go ahead and look at the three string way. 
So the three string way is gonna be very much similar to the four string way, but we're just gonna use the first, second, and third string. So you just go ahead, set your index finger on the second fret of the first string. And then I like to put my ring finger here on the fourth fret of the third string, pinky right underneath that on fourth fret of the second string. Now we're focusing our strum just on the high three strings. So you've got down, up, down, up, down. So what I do, I kind of cheat. I, I try to mute out the fourth string with the top of my ring finger. So. All right, now the F sharp minor and the three string method looks like this. Index finger, fourth fret of the first string, middle finger, fifth fret of the second string, ring finger, sixth fret of the third string. I hope I said that right. Again, just focusing the strum on the highest three strings. Now, uh, the C sharp minor, really easy, I, I feel. You just bar right here, fourth fret. You just bar across first, second, and third string. So. Really easy to get that C sharp minor. Then for the A, just one finger right here, um, first fret of the third string. All right, so that's the uh, the three string method. Alright, so I hope that helped you get a good start on this song. Go ahead, hit the like and subscribe button, and I'll see you on the next video.